Welcome to The Update, Soul Therapy's weekly news on Korean hip-hop and r and I'm your host, Liv. Before we dive into the video, to stay up to date with all our future K-hip-hop content, hit the subscribe button and the bell for notifications so you don't miss out. An official boy took to Instagram to call out New Champ for spreading rumours. The two have crossed paths during their time on Show Me The Money and Unofficial Boy is upset that New Champ told Diesel that Gamma spoke badly about him. As Unofficial Boy is a close friend of Gamma's and is scared scheduled to perform in Diesel's concert next week, New Champ spreading this around puts him in a very difficult position. An official boy said he feels it makes him look like a bad friend to both of them after they supported him through a difficult time he went through when Fame Records broke up. He also said he knows New Champ has caused problems with other artists such as Son Simba and Kwon Ki Beck and that he's disappointed as he listened to his music growing up but he'll mess up his career now. Waterbomb is shaping up to be the most exciting festival of the year, with too many huge names to even list, but I'll try my best. Jesse, Sick K, Kugi, Hwasa, Giri Boy, Marani, Bio, and Lee Young Ji have all joined the lineup. Not to mention Ha On, who's been MIA for a long time, and fans went wild to see his return. Unsurprisingly, tickets to Waterbomb Seoul are currently sold out. Show Me The Money 8, 9 and 10 contestant Yanu has announced that he is leaving Halftime Records, who he has been with since his debut in 2020. Halftime was founded by fellow Show Me The Money 9 alumni Lil Boy and the label commemorated his departure with a post on Instagram celebrating his works with them and wishing him well. Dynamic Duo have been announced as the MCs of KBS's new producer battle series, Listen Up. The show will also feature Palo Alto, Big Naughty, Peak Boy and many others and premieres on the 30th of July. This has been The Update. Don't forget to like, share and comment telling us what you thought about this week's news. I'll see you next week.